JT Sounds is asking about Justin Flo, uh, an official visit for the Louisville game. Um, so what are the chances with Justin Flo, with him locked in for an official visit? Um, I still say very low, honestly. Um, again, you know, Miami's competing against Georgia, Clemson, Alabama, and I forget who the other one is, maybe USC, because he's a California kid. Um, and, you know, there could be a team like a Texas A&M uh, who wants to pop up, maybe an Oregon, because they recruit uh, really well with Mario Cristobal and everything. So we'll see. Um, but this is along the – this is a step along the path, and we will see where this leads. I think that a 3-3 three and three start is really prohibitive for a player of his caliber. So I think it's going to take a, a yeoman's recruiting effort by the entire staff to get Justin Flo to actually commit to the University of Miami. Um, I'm also interested to see what his preferred number means in that pursuit as well, because the number 10 is retired at the University of Miami for George Myra Sr. for many years. And that's the number that Justin Flo wears. So I don't know if him being able to wear his, you know, the, his iconic number now in high school, at least that number is going to get retired at Upland Hill or Upland High School in California, the number 10 that he wears. I don't know if that plays a factor in there. And that's just me as a person, not even a connected recruiting blogger or anything. That's just me, Cameron, thinking, hey, I wonder what that is or what that means to him in this pursuit. Um, but like I said, you know, and I, I've written in the recruiting rules and I've said before, it, it takes at least two, if not three visits for a five-star out-of-state player to be considered a real option in anybody's recruiting class. You need to see a camp, an unofficial, and an official visit. I think this is number two for Justin Flo. So it is in the realm of possibilities, but I still think he's going to Clemson 100% until I hear otherwise. But stranger things have happened. Five stars have flipped late in the process. Everybody knows I used to work at Miramar High School. Everybody knows that Tracy Howard was going to the University of Florida until he took that last weekend official visit to Miami and then changed his mind. Um, I did not speak to Tracy or his brother or his mother or his father, all people who I had interacted with at Miramar to that time. P.S. Uh, rest in peace to his father. He passed away, I think, like a year and a half ago. Uh, but I did not speak to them before that. And I said, he's coming to Miami. And people called me all kinds of names. Uh, and then he ended up coming to Miami. Tracy Howard, that is, is a five-star player, top 20 player in the class. So things have happened. I have not necessarily seen it with out-of-state guys like Justin Flo, and I mean, Justin Flo is like a top three player in the country overall. So uh, still a, a tough road to hoe, still a, a huge mountain to climb there, but uh, it's a step in the right direction, getting him down for an official visit, you know, get him down, show him a good time, shoot our shot, win a game, and then we'll see what happens. Corey, Jeff, thank you so much for the contribution. We appreciate it. Uh, thank you, Cam and Mark, as always. Love this show. Go Canes. So I want to remind everyone that you can contribute uh, to what we do here in a number of ways, uh, simply by liking the video. That helps the algorithms of YouTube and helps push us to better places in regards to recommended videos and attracts more people into the audience. And why does that matter? You may figure, hey, as long as I'm watching, what do I care if there's 10 people watching or 1,000 people watching? Well, you should care because the more encouragement we get from you, the more influence we can gain and more people we can get on here and the more probability that we can sustain this and it can thrive and grow and we can continue to do this. Cam's got a full-time job. He runs a major website and he does this for us each and every week as well.